Hello, Lucifer here. Recently, we have posted my fifth prophecy, which concerned the philosopher Ayn Rand as a secular prophet. Rand challenged traditional moral assumptions and championed what she called the virtue of selfishness. Funny thing, the diverse opinions about morality. Rand claims hers to be the objectively definitive brand of right and wrong, absolute morality. But objectively, if there is indeed no god of judgment, can there be any such thing as absolute morality implied in the workings of nature? No, of course not. All of life except the human community responds and reacts according to instinct, and some slight ability among the more endowed toward learning that might influence some behavior. Dolphins and some species of whales would be the exceptions, these having a unique orientation that I will not get into here. People bother dolphins and whales enough as it is. Now, morality is just a convention whereby the human community organizes itself. In place of preset instincts, humans establish rules of conduct to keep things from falling into chaos. For a long time, under patriarchal dominance, this was mainly about some descendant of some bully who pushed everybody around with the help of his uh, gang. Thus, from the beginning, be it about the seen or unseen realms, order, good, chaos, bad. Generally, moralists are not my favorite species of human. But prophets are invariably moralists, and my videos primarily concern themselves with prophecy. So eventually I must get around to critiquing the moral thinking of those secular thinkers like Rand and Marx, and then the mystical prophets like Nostradamus and the uh, biblical seers. As for Yeshua, the one you call Jesus, I will devote a little video to him that will serve as a, the follow-up to this one. One should watch for it in the coming weeks. Thank you. 